All new this morning, a Metro Atlanta school system makes the decision to buck the trend and start the school year offering some in person classes instead of all virtual learning. Christy Diaz joins us live from her home in Fulton County with a breakdown of Fayette County schools plans. Good morning, Christy. Good morning, Francesca. It is just the latest to make changes to this new school year, just days before it was supposed to start. They were supposed to go in person completely, but now they have changed to a hybrid model of some in person classes, some virtual, and now they have pushed back the start date twice. So here are the most important facts if you are a Fayette County family. The first day of school is now August 17th. Families have a choice between full virtual and brick and mortar learning. And if you choose the brick and mortar, it's a hybrid schedule. That means students pre-K through second grade will return to school five days a week, but grades three through 12 will attend on an A-B schedule, meaning face-to-face -face two days a week and virtually the rest of the week. Now, both students and staff will be required to wear face coverings inside school buildings, but they are building in some breaks throughout the day. Now, if you choose the virtual option, it, it's gonna look different for elementary, middle, and high school. Teachers will guide the instruction for elementary and middle students, but high schoolers are on their own and they can complete the coursework anytime, anywhere. They will only go to campus for certain assessments. Now, if this new information has made you change your mind and want to switch your option, you do have the ability to do that. They have reactivated the school choice form, but you have to make your final selection by midnight tonight.